Hey, so I need two minutes of your time first because before I get into this video, I want to show you exactly what I'm trying to accomplish in this video showing you. But let's listen to just two minutes of audio or less of what I hear every day and then I'll explain why I'm making this video. You may say CB radio is dead, nobody's using it, CB radio is not real radio, and I've had this argument before where I've told you, you know, CB radio is definitely a viable source of communication, and it's just plain out fun. Why can't we have a little bit of fun, right? Well, I'm just going to show you a little snippet of what I've heard every single day on CB, okay, in the last couple of months throughout the summer this is every day and what's funny is I don't know how people say they haven't heard anything on 10 meters in years when CB is open like this 10 meters is open go look at the go look at the propagation go go try it okay but in the meantime CB radio why is CB radio always get that you know that bad name so the reason I'm making this video is I listen to a talk show, talk radio show, uh, 101.7 in West Palm Market, WZZR, Love Doctors, and they have topics, and you know, one of the topics that came up again was about that app, you know, where you can get traffic jams and stuff on the app, and it shows you on the highway, what's it called, Waze or something like that, and somebody called in to the radio station, and they said, yeah, I remember back in the day when CBs were still around, nobody does CBs anymore, but those were great when we were on the road on a CB radio, you would hear about smoky reports and this and that. And then they started laughing and talking and, you know, making fun of CB, you know, playing songs, Breaker 1 9, good buddy, you know. And they said, nobody does CB anymore. And of course, I had to call in and say, excuse me, as your radio authority, I could tell you that CB radio is still alive. And they were like, what? That's right, broadcasting over how many thousands of people in West Palm that were listening to that radio station. I said, yes, CB radio is still alive, but they still don't, you know, they said, okay, we'll take your word for it, but I don't think anybody, I don't know anybody with a CB radio. There are people out there that are still on CB radio, and that's how I started in radio when I was nine years old, okay? CB radio is still being used, and it's still a very viable part of radio communication, whether it be for fun or emergency communications. CB radio is just another form of radio communication. The thing is this, guys, I just want you to know, this is how I started in radio with CB. I always have a CB in my vehicle. And I've met a lot of people on CB that got hooked and they went to ham radio. So you can't say CB is that bad. But what you can say is if I go up to 10 meters, you'll hear nothing. But on CB... See, there's California. There's New York, there's uh, Kentucky. How's your weather today? You see, these are people that are actually communicating like human beings. What's wrong with that? Why do people who are hams say, oh, yeah, CB radio? They're having fun, man. Let them have fun. They're not hurting anybody. Nobody's monitoring the CB anymore, it's not regulated. It's not shared with medical equipment or RC cars anymore. 
let the people have fun. That's what they're doing. That's what I do with radio. Okay? And, you know, a lot of them have numbers that they make up, you know. I usually use 382. You know, 382 frustration down here in the great state of Florida. You know, whatever. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's nothing real professional. I don't really get on here much lately and talk. I've, I've worked some people, but I don't live on here every day. I got uh, other radios. In fact, my 7100 and a new antenna is coming for this. I'm going to put HF back in here. Um, you know, 80 through 6 or whatever. Anyways, moral of the story, get if, if you're a, if you're not a ham radio operator and you have a CB, you're going to get a CB, fine, listen. Okay? You're going to hear people out there. Okay, so he's using 450 watts and he's got an Ameritron. Big deal. He's using a ham amplifier. But you know what? He's having fun. And guess what? I guarantee he's a ham. But everybody keeps telling him the bands are dead, nobody's on, so he's making contacts right, on 11 meters. Antenna is nothing more than a Browning quarter wave NMO style whip antenna that can be tuned on 10 or 11. I got it with an Amazon gift card, but that's all I'm using, and it's a weird mounting position, right? Well, it's tuned flat, but it is uh, definitely a decent antenna on Amazon. I mean, can't go wrong. So the moral of the story is this. CB Radio is alive and well in 2019. I encourage you to check out CB Radio if you're a person who thinks you want to get in radio and you're like, well, Eric makes these videos on ham radio and that's not really for me, but I would do a CB, but everybody tells me nobody's on CB Radio. Well, there's actually quite a lot of people on there. Okay? Sometimes so many people you can't listen to just one. And I come home on the 7300 with the vertical, you can see there's activity.